Okay, good afternoon, everybody. Uh, today I'm going to go over lesson 2.5.4, uh, basic Java, and this is uh, casting to an end. Okay, we covered this before, uh, different data types, and now they're wanting you to convert one data type to another. All right, and so we have our name of the program, the class, casting to an end. Uh, this is our method start run. And these are, this is the block of statements or the block of code. And the assignment is asking for, uh, let me see, write a program that casts the double value, 3.14, into an integer. So that we're going to cast it into a small one. And it wants to print the, print the value to the screen. So whatever the result is, it wants to, to print it. And see what's going on here. So this one is just saying that there's a difference in how, the, in how it's being printed out. So what we're going to do is this. The first thing we're going to do is uh, double is your data type. And remember, that's uh, anything with a decimal. It's going to be a double. That's your variable name, my double. So you can name it anything you want. And in this case, it's named my double is. And this is what read double is what you're going to ask the user to input a decimal. Uh, please input your double. So that's the question. It comes out. They put it in. And now they're going to grab that information, my double, and convert it. Okay, into an int. So you're casting that information in. And it's going to convert it to an int. That's going to have a new variable assigned to it, and that's their int. That's data type int. Finally, you print it out. This is your class, your object, and your uh, method. So system.out print their int, and that's that variable. You're calling it back up. All right. And if I run it, which uh, it looks like it's good, but it's giving you an error. That tells me that uh, with Code High School, you have to be, you have to do exactly what they want. If you don't, it's going to give you errors like in this one. And I can tell it now by looking at it, it's going to be uh, the value. So they're giving us the answer already. They're telling us it's what they want. They don't want anything else but that. So we're going to let's get rid of all this right here. Okay, so we're going to say that the value that they're requesting, which is 3.14, we're going to add that in there. That's what they're calling for. It's going to be putting my double, double, my double. That's an int. You're casting it in there. That now has a new variable name, their int. That's data type int. So that is an int. So that's holding that in memory. And it's going to give you that back, that information. It's going to convert it to a, to a 3, pretty much. And... If we go back into our check code, let's see if it still has any problems. Okay, it still gives us the same error. Actually, it went away, but it's saying that we're not doing it correctly. So, let's look at what it's wanting. The screen. All right. So, um, this looks good, but I'll, I'm going to say that if we started working with print lines, remember, I think we talked about that earlier, but you have to. We're getting to a point now where we're, we're not just doing print anymore on a single line. They want us to do it on the second line, and that kind of gives you that right here. Print this value. That's your second line. So they want us to do it on the second line. So because the reason for it is it's already been put in there. That value has been put in. It's going to take it and bring it back. So you want to throw that into a second line. So that's a new line. And like I said, remember, it's like printing, uh, hitting the enter key on your keyboard. When you finish a line, you hit an enter, you get to the next line. That's exactly what they're wanting because you got your first line, second line. Uh, it's not always going to be that case. You're going to have to kind of experiment with code high school stuff because their stuff is just, you know, it's unique to this environment. Uh, and I'll always help you guys. You just got to get reach out to me. But this is it. So this looks good now. Let's check it out. Uh, let's go back here. Let's check the code. Make sure it's run. And now it likes it. So you just got to kind of do what they want you to do, and, and uh, you're going to be fine. That's just sometimes it takes a little bit of a guesswork, I guess. You got to guess, okay, uh, then I like print, so let's try this. Let's try this. Uh, you have different types of print. You got print F, print LN, and print, all right? Um, anyways, uh, if you guys have any more questions or need more help, go ahead and reach out to me, and I'll, I'll uh, try to help you as best as I can. Talk to you later. Bye.